Hey guys, Alex here, playing some more Civilization <coughs> 5. And we just got a trade. One gold turn no. But we will accept your <coughs> embassy. Um You can found a new city with your settler. Move your. Yes, guys. Um, we sort of had a couple technical problems in the sense that um, civilization wanted to be a bit of a dick. Let's just say. That's that's the only nice way to put it. So. Okay. Now I think Washington will start to be a more militaristic city. So Washington will be where we produce all our military. Because I mean the capital has to be the safest city, right? Right? Yeah. So I basically, it took about half an hour to get us back up to this point. So yeah, well, it took it. Yeah, it took ages to get back up to this point in the game, but I did it. Your settler is alone outside your borders. No, it isn't. Captured. It's not outside our borders by itself. It's right there. People who like shiny things the most. Us. Thank you. Tanks. Okay. It's exciting. We're going to settle New York. Operation Settle New York is a boot to be done. Is a boot to be done. A couple things changed as well, just so you know. Our people will be the most well-fed people ever. Because we got bananas, we got silk, we got dyes, we got marble, we got a farm, we got we got everything. We're even gonna have gems. I <laughs> know, right? Okay, so this is what I like to do. Okay. So you buy that tile. You buy that tile. And instead of going out, and instead of use going and doing all that, you guys are going to route uh, to New York. Okay, so this is. So New York. Now this city of New York. What can its specialization be? It can't be trading. Because it's yeah. because it's not near water and you can't get boats. Okay, we're going to do arches just so it can protect itself with ranged units. So writing is is about to be researched. Right now we're doing very well because we've already taken out an encampment, a barbarian encampment. We've taken out oh we haven't taken out anything. He who destroys a good book kills reason itself. That is very true. He who destroys a good book destroys reason itself. 
Wiser words have been spoken. No. Oh, I thought those were meteors. Like, where it smashed into like a hill and it creates like a giant crater. That, that was going to be pretty cool. <laughs> okay, so New York. So, New York's uh, specialty is going to be making more cities, like producing settlements. So, cargo ships. Right now, we're going to do that. <coughs> Oh wow, it's already been six minutes. This has gone really fast. Okay. So we're still in the BC. 2000 BC. You guys probably couldn't see it because that's where my webcam is going. But you can see it right across the screen. Go right across it. Boom. Bam. We have eight more turns till trapping has been researched and done. Then we can go to masonry. Then we can get the marble. Then we can. It just leads to an entire string of events that'll be very good for us. Oh, Gandhi! In the name of the people of India. I offer you my hand in friendship. That sounds a bit gay, but I guess that's what um, people back then would say. To to our generation, that would sound gay, but back then, that's what they said. Don't question it, because or else people would question. People do it, it's not very good. Okay, so there are two families and five families, so all together in our civilization we have seven families all up. Because five means when you have um, Washington or New York or whatever is grown. That means a new family has been made. So, yeah, that, that's what it means. So, it doesn't mean there's only two people. It means that there are two fam full families living in that city, or five full families, either, however many. Oh, we can get that citrus. Like I said, guys, we are going to be one of the most wealth people. Okay. Library. Also, having libraries, don't ever pass on that. Don't ever say that that's not important because it is. Because you you see this up here, the science, the little blue test tube thingy, that's your science bar thing, and it tells you how much science you are producing, which uh, inflicts on how fast you research things. I had a big problem with that in number four because I really didn't get it. And I kept on going from 100% to 50% to 80% and back down to like 20 or 30% in the um, uh, science. Oh boy. Cities can't bomb. Ah, shura ye mate dane akar shu. Kargina kaya ana. Even brute beasts and wandering birds do not fall into the same traps or nets twice. Mm -hmm. 
Mathematics is something that you'd want to get real early in the game, okay? So, now I get it. Get it. Where we are researching mathematics, which doesn't make sense because mathematics is a research itself. So basically people are doing mathematics to improve their understanding of mathematics, which is right now confusing the heck out of me. But hey, you know? You know? Yeah, you go back and protect New York. They're, they're wandering away now, so. And I swear, if you come back, you're gonna be dead. Die Erzherzog in zu Österreich heißt eure Eminenz. Willkommen in. Ach, bringen wir es hinter uns. Um vier wird gespeist. Hm. Okay. I like her. She. If. If she, if Austria ever asks you to open borders with them, do it because they because they will be one of the biggest helps in late game stages because what I've found they become very militaristic for some reason in the late stages of the game so you know. Look at them workers working their butts off. Okay. Okay, so you see these guys over here? These guys might get in our way later on in the future, and so that will need to be dealt with, but not right now. They, they do tend to get in your way really late on in the game, and Sometimes it can make you pretty mad because you're trying to expand your civilization, but you can't. There's nowhere to go. So then you have. So then you're forced to go to war with someone that you really don't want to. Later on in the game, these guys will not matter very much to you, and you can just take them out. No one will really care. Because they're not, because they won't do much at all to you, and and after explaining that, I'm gonna have to cut the video here. So, if you like this video, leave a like and a comment. If you really, really like this video, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye.